is, you know who I be. It ain't no secret. It's Mr. Lines coming to you live and direct on this tantalizing Tuesday, March the 2nd, 2020. Mas uno, C, 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 yes, 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 let's see it with our chest. We are in here like the atmosphere. So you know what we gonna do, dawg? We gonna G. A T A and get after these academics, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Not only is it a tensilizing Tuesday, March the second, but they March day number one hundred what fourteen of our oh one hundred fifteen. I done lost today. One hundred fifteen of our calendar school year. Yes, yes, yes. We are moving along. Move, wait, man. We are moving so fast. I done lost count myself. We will be here to the end. I think this year we're gonna have one hundred seventy-eight days in the calendar school year. So look out, look out, look out, and let it shout. All right, our quote today comes from George Evans: All students can learn and succeed, but not at the same day, in the same way. Yes, we all got different learning styles. Yes, we do. We all got, all teachers got different, different learning styles too. All right? I know I do. All right? So, we're going to make it happen. We're going to make it happen with that said done. Ooh-wee! The weather today is going to be a little freezy, freezy. I don't like cold. All right? Right now, it feels like 30 degrees. Um, 30 degrees. The high today is going to be only 53. And the low is 33. All right? So, that's like I said yesterday, who's going to be kind of chilly this week? But who cares? We inside getting this education in. All right, next up, next up, next up. Ooh, wee, I got a birthday today. And it is who? Mr. Ben Johnson. Happy birthday, Ben Johnson. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday. Yeah. There it is, Mr. Johnson. There it is, there it is. Now, y'all know what's going on. Y'all know what's going on. Y'all know what's going on here at Carter Community Charter School. Hey, man, I'm just going to jump into it. I'm just going to jump into it. Classroom updates. Let's go get it. All right, this, um, hey, it's going down right now. It's going down right now. Oh, it's going down right now. Oh, God, it's going on. It's going on now, right now. Ooh-wee. Ooh-wee. Oh, my goodness. Uh oh I don't know. Oh, there she go. There she go. There go that pretty Miss Beatty. Hey, Miss Beatty in the kindergartens is up first. All right, this Tuesday, ELA. Uh, oh, the places you will go read by Michelle Obama. Oh, yes. We will discuss the main topic and the key details of the story. And then math, 10 frames, addition to 10, in addition to 20, using boom cards. Oh, yeah, y'all ready? Y'all ready? That's like simple review for y'all. That's simple review for y'all. Next up, next up, I got who? I got Mrs. Williams this Tuesday. Y'all counting bills and coins combos. It's going down. It's going down. And then Mrs. Colson said this to the students to read a book, Back to School Rules, and we would talk about school rules and goals, all right? Then, then the students would write, what is the main important rule? What's the most important rule? All right, yes, yes, what's your most important rule? All right, and then next up, next up, I got Miss Karen in the second grade. We're going to work on some the truth, read aloud in discussion, we're going to finish uh, place and level up independent reading. Second grade, ooh, I love it, I love it, I love it. Hey, invite me back, invite me back. I've got some time, i got a couple minutes, let me come on in and check y'all out. All right, next up, Miss Green in third grade. Tuesday, y'all going to be fractions as it relates to parts of a group and parts of a whole. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Bingo was his name. Oh, all right. Next up, next up, I got who? Fourth grade, Mrs. Archer. Mrs. Archer said, hmm, this Tuesday, map testing. This Wednesday, map testing. This Thursday, map testing. This Friday, so we're going to finish up in incomplete work. And if I got any missing map testing, you're going to do that on Friday, too. All right, and then I got Mrs. Bradby. Mrs. Bradby, this Tuesday. Hey, we're going to reading map test this morning in fifth grade. And we're going to finish up analyzing Esperanza Rising, chapter four activities for Miss Bradby. And you know, the same thing. This morning, we're going to start our map testing on uh, ELA. And then for us, after you finish, you're going to complete all oh, you missing work, don't act like you ain't got none because we all got it. All right, on number patterns, all right, and then we're going to uh, parts of plants. <laughs> so study island, study island, learn the phone, learn the phone, ISL, ISL, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. All right, next up, hey, let's go ahead and get into that middle school. All right, so middle school, I got Mrs. Blakes, Mrs. Bats, Mr. Michael, Mrs. Ships. Woo! Four man team. Pow, pow, pow. Let's get it. All right, math. In sixth grade, students will prove understanding of areas 2D and 3D shapes. You got a quiz tomorrow. All right. Uh, in ELA, students will continue uh, with lesson four. In unit five, y'all also look at the main idea and also reviewing commas for the grammar portion of the lesson. All right, and then in science, students are reviewing heat transfer. Oh, I know you know heat transfer. I just told it to you. All right, students went more about conductors and insulators. The heat transfer quiz is going down Thursday. All right, and then social studies, people, um, students review the Crusades. Oh, yes, the religious Crusades. All right, and the students will use predetermined lists of websites on religion and a list of ancient worlds. Group presentations or do are going down starting on Thursday. All right, seventh grade students will be able to write, simplify, and factor expressions. All right, using properties in order of the 
proper oration. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. All right, then, ELA, you will be continuing the lesson five and six. All right, and then you look at the main idea and I'm reviewing pronoun and the agreement and grammar portion of the lesson. Yes, 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 yes. All right, and then in science, students will learn about plant and animal cells and organelles. I know you know. I told that too, all right? And then you have a quiz on Thursday. Now the students will explain how increased global interactions accelerates the pace of innovation, innovation in modern societies. And examples of these innovations are advancements in transportation, communication networks, and business practices. And then in eighth grade, all right, science students will be able to calculate the volume of cylinders and cones. Hey, how did I, how did y'all do on that uh, quiz yesterday on volumes of cylinders? All right, ELA, you continue with lesson four in unit five. You will analyze arguments and you review compound sentences for grammar portion of the lesson. And then as science students will learn about the difference between pandemic, epidemic, and what else? Huh? Huh? What's the other pandemic, epidemic, who? Outbreaks. All right, then I'm talk about these pathogens. Have a quiz um, yesterday, and now. I like to know how well y'all do that. Who scored hundreds? Who scored hundreds? Who scored hundreds? Who made an A? All right. And then last but not least, students will learn how culture were the Carolinas, and the students will use graphic organizers to start on their current event projects. You know who I am. You know who I be. It ain't no secret. I'm missing lines on everybody to take your date and your academics. We're relentless to nasty and bend your will towards greatness. I am missing lines. And remember, one family, one falcon, one flight. Hello.